Hello, and welcome back to Day Off Gaming. We are going to continue our way through the game Dredge today. Uh, let's see where we left off. We have a few items of um, improvements, basically a couple of cloth and metal scraps. Uh, we do have a couple of pursuits right now. Well, actually just the one, mostly to find a music box and gale. Uh, cliffs, a ring, a necklace, and a watch. Uh, so let's see what trouble we can get in today. I cannot remember if we have some crab pots. Yes, we do. So we are going to, I think, grab a couple of these. One day left. For right now, we'll go ahead and leave these here. We'll grab these. Sell them. I think after this day, we'll head off to the Gale Cliffs to start the next bit of our adventure. Um, I do want to start picking some of these up. We're going to put them in storage for right now. Uh, let's go ahead and actually go sell these items real quick. Come on, get me over here. There we go. Trader, let's sell some things to you, sir. If you do not mind. Not too bad. That brings us along pretty well. Gets up to 500. Let's get this little bit of flotsam here. Oh, that's all that's there. Alright. Um, what do we have ability for? We do have coastal, shallow, oceanic, and dredge. So we can get some of these sharks if we want. Uh, let's see. What are we missing for them from this area? I'm kind of curious. Have we caught everything? It does look like we got everything. Great. Well, at least of the main fish. Um, pursuits. Make sure. Did we help out? I'm going to help out one individual. Which we will want to eventually. Let's get some more dredge. I really want to get some of our research up. We need a better ship. Right now this one has very little space, I feel like, for what we want to do. We will be getting in after dark, which is fine. I'm not too worried about it. We depleted it. Alright, let's see what we got around here. What can we fish? I did actually toy on the side to see uh, what to do when those fish boats show up in the dark. And it sounds like a good idea of us not dealing with them, us running away. Uh, if you use your horn, you actually call them to you. Uh, it was... Something I was not expecting to have happen uh, when I started toying around with this. And I was like, oh, well, that's not good. And we're going to run into space issue, aren't we? Oh, there we go. Look at that. We can make this fit. Uh-oh, there's a boat out there. Let's head out. Oh, there's a boat in front of us. That's not good either. And there's eyes in the water. That's not good either. Um... We don't have space right now, but I think we're going to do a little bit of night fishing here. I want those two aberrations. I think. I don't think we have them. We might want to double check. Maybe we'll get lucky. Uh, let's clear that. Let's get this dry dock. Let's see what we're missing. We're missing a bolt of... Ooh, we have a bolt of cloth. That's great. All right. In that case, we are ready to start getting up to a new hole. So let's 
do a little bit of that, shall we? Oh, don't have room for that. Look at that, we're already halfway there. This refined metal, we're gonna have to figure out where that's at. But I really would like to get an additional whole, uh, basically hit point, and to have a little bit more cargo space and everything. That'd be great. Um, oh, we do have another one of these. Uh, let's take a look at our research. Let's see where we're at. We got an engine. We do have these super engines, the jet water. Um, I would like to get this improved trawl eventually. I think right now, let's just let's just hold on to it, just just for right now. Got a brood squid. And I saw something over here too. So I want this too. Be a little greedy. Oh, we missed uh There we go. Ooh, a tusk grouper. I think this right here is supposed to be what's left of our boat. That we kind of ran into ground. Oh, something got into our hold. Ah, oh, that's gonna be an infected fish. What well, got infected? Oh, one of our black groupers. Oh, oh well, that can happen at night. Uh, let's get another one. In. Hold on, I want to see. Yeah, let's refund this because I don't know. What are we using currently for crab uh, crab pots right now? One, two, three, four. I think we actually let's pick these all up. Okay, we do. We are using these. Great. So yeah, let's go ahead and just pick all these up. We will sell what we got. We're going to grab these guys. Whoop. And let's repair these. Ooh, you know what I'd really like to do is have better lighting at night. That would be really... Ooh, having some more engine space would be great too. Um, only an hour. Let's repair everything. Let us actually rest. Uh, make sure, okay. So we got some rest. Let's grab a new engine. Install that. I think we're okay for right now for um, lights. I'm not gonna worry about it because of course it's middle of the day. We are fully spot on. I think we're going to go ahead and head out for right now. We are going to head towards the Gale Cliffs, which are all the way over here. Got a little lightning going on. We're going right into a storm. We got this. We are the amazing fishermen. Oh, we got some dolphins going along with us. Oop, looks like there's a area up here that we can't do. Hold on, where is it? Yep. We need a Bissell. Hmm. We just have to figure out how to get a fishing pole for it. Because right now it won't let us research it. Not too bad. We got over here at a decent uh, amount of time, I think. It took us about four hours. Four or five hours. What we got here? 
All right, so we need to do it as get up to the top here. Simple enough. All right, let's see what else we have here. Some stonefish. Not too bad. Let's actually come back over here. Maybe do a little bit more fishing. We got some time. One more, I think. Whoops. Yeah. Not a problem. Oh, we have a little, uh, thing out there. We'll go check that out here in a sec. Ah. Traveling merchant. Ahoy there! You're a new face. A fisherman, I take it. Perfect. Well, we should get along like a house on fire. <laughs> I'm a traveler and a merchant. All round into one. If you have any fish to sell... I'll take him on board and sell him at the next town I come across. <laughs> Likewise, I haul small cargo equipment between places. You're welcome to per per peruse the stock and see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. I'm pretty sure that sounds very high-pitched. I apologize to you all. Oh. Hey again. Come by for a chat. Do you need help with anything? Assistance from an angler? Absolutely! I've been trying to collect rewards of where each species of fish is located. I've figured out most of them on my travel so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. Reckon you could share your info with me? Sure! Great! The fish I left to track down are or a fish, gulper eel, goliath tigerfish, and some word I cannot pronounce, colacanth. That's what we're going to call it anyway. I know a little about each species already, so maybe I can point you in the right direction. Hmm. What do you want to know? Tell me about oarfish. Given that oarfish are long and fragile body, I suspect they'll live in reasonably deep but calm water. Maybe the sheltered gale cliffs would suit them. Okay. I'll be honest. I've never seen an oarfish, so... Maybe they're a night fish? That's possible. What about the other fish? Gulper eels. I know that gulper eels live in the deepest depths imaginable. You'll have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. What about the other fish? Goliath tigerfish. These guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky, swampy waters using the shade of trees as cover. What about the other fish? What about this colacanth? Colacanths. Actually, I have no idea where colacants might be, but they have a primordial feel to them, don't you think? Well, that tells me absolutely nothing. Uh, so, let's see. I've got all the information I need. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Um... What do you know about Gale Cliffs? Well, there's Angville, just across the bay. Which is a dreary little whaling town. The folks there are always in the need of something. Which keeps me in business. <sighs> the residents are always talking about the quiz. Most seem afraid. Frankly, I'm not sure why they stay. Occasionally I hear deep rumblings from within the rocks. I don't hang around here though for long. Well, she's uh, so helpful. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we can do. On this side... Oh, we can sell some fish and we can sell get some crab, pot, uh, crab pots. I cannot talk tonight. I apologize. Well, $80, not too bad. So let's see what we got. A shipyard. Sounds like just about normal. Uh, let's build up our engine. We definitely want to build up our engine. We want to get from one place to another. Uh, we will definitely want to get better lights. That is for sure. Um, 
What else have we got? Ooh, what is this? Refined metal. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, where are we at? Uh, oh, what's it? Uh, dry docks. Okay. It might be used. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we need that right there. So we have to spend $500 for that. Ouch. Well, we do have some crab pots. So let's see if we can drop off some around here. Uh oh. There's another scary thing out there. Oh, give me a give me shallow ground. There we go. All right. Oh, what's this? Oh, these things are yeah. Tricky, tricky, tricky. I think, yeah, I think that's all we're gonna get here. I do want this bottle, though. What is the bottle? Ooh, there's something trying to sneak into our ship there. I think that little, uh, bot that little, uh, thing you saw there, uh, that tried to, that popped up, I think that is something that tries to sneak onto your ship, and I think that's what causes your fish to become infected, uh, at night time. <sighs> it's just a theory, but it seems to hold pretty close to what I've seen, um, when I have played this, even in this game, uh, that I'm playing right now. Okay. I, am, I know I was looking for something. I went fishing, got dropped by. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and just wait till dawn. My mind kind of shut off there for a little bit. That was not intentional. Let's see what. Let's see. Where are we? We are here. Let's go check out these towns. Oh, I think that's probably a bad idea to hit that. A retired whaler? And we have a potential pursuit. Let's check that out. What is it? Do you need help with anything? I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner. But I've been having some issues. Around here we consider aged conquer eels to be a particular delicacy. You may say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Normally we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. Bad dog. You're not supposed to be doing that. I can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Can you bring me an aged conger eel? Sure. Thank you. You'll be decently compensated. Okay, so where can I catch one of these? Ah yes, that can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you may have to venture into the passageways of the cliffs to find them. Oh, and did I mention they only come out at night? Of course they would. Yes, I believe they hide during the day. That's going to make things fun. Good luck. Well, let's see. Do you know? Can you tell us about the cliffs? Mm -hmm. Many years ago, the cliffs used to be a haven for smugglers and pirates. Legend tells of two pirate lords who used Gale Cliffs as their hideout. Ooh, interesting. Supposedly, they got into some disagreement and a huge battle was fought along the south side of the cliffs. There's certainly a large number of wrecks in that area. I hope so, because I really need some uh, dredge stuff to get researched on. Both sides were completely destroyed. The treasure hordes were left abandoned and unclaimed to this day. I dare say they'd be worth a lot if anyone knew where to find them. Well, I think we are going to be that person. Um, let's see. Do you know any... Well, we know where to sell our fish because we saw the floating uh, port across the way. So we don't need to worry about that. Do you know of any odd characters? Hmm. Have you heard the tell him Magrin? He was an old weller from these parts. As the whales got more scarce, crews spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. Magarin, it seems, wasn't cut out for this. 
he formed an unnatural attachment to a scroll he found on one of these trips. He says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish. People started calling him Magarin the Fisherman. One day the town awoke to find all the boats, nets, and lines had been slashed in the night and old Magarin was nowhere to be found, nor has he ever been seen since. Hmm. I wonder if it's somebody we might some maybe find sometime? Um uh, I've not played this game long enough to know what we may or may not find. So we will find out. I do have to say I find this game very relaxing. Even though especially at night you have to be under guard a lot. I really do enjoy this game. Oh, that's all that. Alright, let's see what else we can find. Um, I do want to try and steal fish, if possible. Uh, because we do want to still get money coming in. Let's go sell that, and then we'll go clear out what we have. Oop, let's get to haste. I will admit this uh, haste ability is really nice. <laughs> Gets us from one spot to another very quickly. Alright, let's clear this out. Before. That's not a lot, but it'll do. We need, do need this wood, though. That is for sure. We need to save up to get this 500. Uh, that's probably one of our main priorities right now. Because um, that's expensive in itself. So we're going to need 1,000 between this 500 for this and 500 for that. That is... That's a lot. Do I have any books still to read? No. Okay. Well, we got a new type of fish. Black mouth salmon. Hey, Black Mouth. Ooh. Oh, we don't want you. Um, let's see if we can do a dra Okay, there's cloth. We do need cloth. Ooh, there is something right there. We do want that. Oop. Oh my gosh. I can hit this, really. Alright. I think this is what we want. Yeah, it's a conger eel. So let's head on back. Now that we've uh, really, whoop! I don't want that. I want that. There we go. Whoa! Let's not hit anything, shall we? We're so scared. We're running scared. Ah! Hey, we made it safely. All right. So, first things first, we do not want to accidentally sell this, so we're going to put this in our storage bin. Because knowing my luck, I would sell it. Um, so let's sell these other fish, though. 
Goody. So we still have that. That's great. Um, we are scared to death because we kept screwing up. Uh, but we can get these. I think we can get these crab pots. Not an issue. Um, let's see. No? Let's see what we have out here, shall we? Ooh, we have a specialty. That's not bad. But we don't really have room for anything else. So let's go ahead and uh, just go. Whoa! <laughs> oh, we lost some rock crab. Ah. Oh, well. We got cocky. We got. We thought we'd make it no problem. But nope, we had to just damage our ship. Oh, well. And spend 30 bucks fixing our ship. Ouch. But let's, uh, rest. Shall we? Alright. That's not bad. I think usually getting up about 5 o'clock, honestly, is about a good time if your, um, uh, fear is minimized. Uh, at least for my nose. Because you can see pretty well where you're going, which is an important thing. So... Let's go ahead and sell this little bit that we have here. Hmm. Uh, let's pick up... Hmm. This item. Let's definitely pick this up. Because we need it. For a new hole. I did see a place where we could get cloth. So let's go ahead and head that way. It was over here somewhere. I want to get the cloth first. And then once we get the cloth, we can do a little exploration and fishing. I think it was right here. That gives us our three cloth that we need. I do see something else that maybe we might want to get. Just a... Uh... Oh, some scrap. Well, we'll need it for when we go on the next level of uh, repairs, so... We do need fish, though. That is important for us, because we do need money. Otherwise, we aren't going to get very far. Ooh, we want that. We're gonna let this just go and go and go and go and... There we go. Get a trophy. Um... That's the blackmouth uh, bass. Uh, sam blackmouth salmon. Helps if I can speak, really. Okay, let's uh, let's not get too greedy. Come on, let's go ahead and get s stuff sold. I have that tendency so much just to go like, let's do something else, even though I know I don't have room. Ooh, you got a book for me. Well, I appreciate it. Take that twenty whole bucks. <laughs> Not a whole lot, but let's see what we can do. Uh, shipyard. No, I don't want shipyard. I want the floating dock. I want to research and get these last bit of things, even though I can't afford it. We'll get there. We'll get the 500. Not 
too bad. All right, let's take that back. It's so hard to see. I definitely need better lights. <laughs> Yeah, what do we got? Not much, I know. It's sad. Um, actually, can I go out here? Let's see what's out here. Can I get this? Um, ooh! Scurrying bass, huh? That's something. I should actually not boost during the night. I really shouldn't unless absolutely necessary. I do see another red light, so that makes me wonder if that's where our next item is. I've been so focused on just trying to get us up another level so that we... Ooh, we need to turn that in. That's rotting. Let's go do that real quick before it rots completely. That'd be bad. And what we'll do is we'll just sleep at this dock, I think, so. What is it? Perfect. This will do wonderfully. I can offer you a small sum in things. Ooh, 150. I'll take that. Safe travels. Yeah. Nothing. Uh, you just made my night. But we will definitely rest until about 5 o'clock. Alright, we need some money. Well, there is... Ooh, what is this over here? I... Don't ask me how I missed this small little uh, docking area over here, but apparently I did. I know that's where we saw the light. Uh, possibly our next uh, artifact. Uh, but... An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Ah. Oh. Ah, greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it that you need today? This place doesn't seem safe. Where do you live here? Do you know how I can there the debris around here? Mm -hmm, that's a good question. Ah. Hmm. Probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother in Ingfeld used to make explosives for the welling operations, you see? Nasty stuff. But the well's all gone. I can't imagine he's still in business. Well, why do you live here if it's unsafe? I... I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My life, my wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Oh. Now I'm all alone and cut off by land and sea, left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. Well, we could help him move. We do have a boat. Oh. It's not that simple. My brother would never, you see, I used to be, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot. Mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. Money. Go figure. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Well, just give it back to him. It's that simple, right? Again, it's not as simple as that. After the collapse, that creature... It dragged debris from the houses down into its wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know. But if you went... If you were to find it, it's a large wheel bone crest. It would mean the world to me. Well, I guess we will look for it. Thank you. Please be careful. Alright. Uh, let's see. Our map... Well, that's showing the X where we need to get our artifact. But it looks like the ship's right there, so we should be able to just simply go straight in. 
And what creature is he talking about? Uh, what is that? What is that? Um, uh, that's a big fish. And we can't go that way. Okay. Um, I don't think I want to know what that is. That's a big fish. It's probably like one of those mean fish that we need. Uh, hold on, where are we? Okay, so if we go straight down this, we should be able to get to it. Okay. Should. Famous last words. And of course, there's a smoking pipe stack in the way. What is this? I'm going to assume this is what we're looking for. It looks big and ugly. Hey, it is. It's the family crest. All right. I have no idea where that big fish ugly thing is. But it looks like it's blocked that way. We can't go that way. We can't go that way. We can go back the way we came. We can't go that way. My gosh, this whole place is just... Blocked. Ooh, there's all those ships they were talking about. Are we in the southern? We are in the southern area. Ooh, nice. Um. Okay. Um. 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 Is something around here? Oh. Oh. Nope. Nope. Up. 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 Nope. Nope. I don't trust that. I don't trust that. I don't trust that. I don't trust that. That's ugly. And it's following us. Okay. Nope. Nope. We we're leaving. We are leaving. Leave us alone. Go go home. Go home. Uh we don't want any of you. If you're anything like your knightly brethren, we definitely do not want you. Uh we have nothing against you or your cause or your species. Uh, we want out of here. Get me out of here. Um here here's your crest. Get away from me. Hermit, here's your crest. I think get get it away from me. <laughs> Hello, what can I do for you? Uh, yeah, I have this thing that this big, uh, huge, uh, ugly fish changed me, and uh, here, enjoy. I don't want it anymore. You found it. I never thought I'd see this beauty again. But now, I have a further favor to ask you. Up oh, there's the big ugly fish. Would you take this to my brother at Engfell? Tell him, tell him his brother is sorry. I would like to come home. Oh, I am so glad it does not attack you when you're at dock. That would suck so bad. That thing went right by us. Oh, wow. Uh, that thing is scary. I do not even want to know what that is. I, I, yeah, no. <laughs> uh,. I have something of yours. Will you please take this off my hand, please? What is it? I believe this crest is yours. Please take it. Oh, God, I haven't seen this since. Hmm. So you did take it. I knew it. Yeah, let's see. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? Hmm. I don't know if I was in the right state when he left. Oh. Okay, fine. He can stay in my old workshop, at least for the time being. But I'll need some time to clear it out. While I'm doing that, perhaps you can do me su do something for me. See, I've been trying to clear some debris in the pathways through the cliffs to make a shortcut with explosives. I was able to set the charge, but the cliffs seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk that name it. You just need to get in there and set it off. It's not far in. Unless some yellow flags nearby, you can't miss it. I think we went right by those. Um. So, I guess I could have done something there, but at the time I was more worried about that big fish. I just didn't know what it was going to do or where it was coming from, and I was like, no way in heck. Uh, so that means we have to go face the, your big demon again, don't we? Great, thank you. Um, you are so... I'm so happy 
Thank you. Okay. Um... I would really like to get the extra hole before we attempt in there. And we missed the fish. Okay. Let's just get what we can. Uh, I would like to definitely upgrade our hole before we go in there. I would like the ability to have an extra hit just in case. Uh, I did not. Oh, that is a lot. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you take so much room. Oh, you take so much room. Why do you have to take so much room? <sighs> take these off my hand, please. Take all. Oh, why do they have to take so much room? Why does my boat have to be so big? We need a bigger boat. Hey, we can actually now do a bigger boat. Awesome. Um, can I move my camera? No? Oh, yeah. I really want to see the difference here. I'm really curious. Alright. So we can actually get a bigger boat. So this is what it looks like right now. So what's it going to look like afterwards? Uh, I want actually another engine space would be nice. Um, so we need wood. And then more cargo space, definitely. Give us all... No. Yep, give us a cargo place. So what do we look like now? Not too different. Um, looks like it has an extra little uh, tire on the front. Or maybe it's just me. Um, but we do actually have an extra point of damage, which is nice. And it looks like a little bit more space for engines, which is really nice. Um, so yeah... I think we're going to definitely just camp here for tonight. I don't trust it just yet. Uh, Z's. Let's get some Z's in us. Oh yeah, we're going to be perfectly fine for morning. Oh yeah. Uh, so he said he has some... Oh, and those are all broken. Okay, fine. We'll go pick these up. We're going to repair. Actually, we don't have money to repair these. No, we might after these, actually. So, let's actually go. Oh, that's gone. What is that? Oh, there's some fish over here. I don't think they were here before, were they? A wreckfish. Sound went out there for a bit, or at least it sounded like it did. Am I gonna have room if I maneuver these guys around? Nope. Okay. Well, it's worth a shot. All right. Let's see how much we can get for this stuff. Awesome. We definitely need that. We need to. Fix our crab pots. Alright. Let's get these down and then we will continue on. I wonder if this might be better. Like, hold on. So we drop one. We drop one. Drop one. Okay. That simplifies it. Um, so we got a little bit better, but we do need to go back in there. But I do want to kind of wander around a little bit more, see what we have in this area. Got some fish there. Got some... what do we got here? Huh? Got some uh, jewelry maybe. Got 
Got a necklace. Okay. Not too bad. Um, what do we have here? We got some more wood. We're going to try and dredge a little bit today. With the... Oh, we got actually a piece of research. Nice. Always a nice thing to get. Some lumber. Went down too fast. Okay, not too bad. Alright, well it's after six. Let's do a quick camera zoom, see what we got. Black mouth, black sea bass, black sea bass. The conger eel, which we did have before. Oh, shit. What is that? Hold on. That is in... Ooh, do we want to tempt fate? I want to tempt fate. I want to go in here, see if we can get in here without our friend seeing us. I think he may have heard us. Yep, I think he heard us. We want to get out of here. Leave us alone. Oh, we got a little panic from the uh, black mist, but we're okay. Think we're gonna make it safe. Think we're gonna make it safe. Think we're safe. Think we're safe. Oh yeah, we're safe. Well, we found some devil rays, though. Interesting. And you're going right by us again, aren't you? Ooh, he makes me so nervous. Every time he comes by, it's just one of those... Ugh. Oh, stay away from me, please. <laughs> Alright, well... Oh, we can buy a research part from you. That's nice. Not sure if we really need it, but that is a nice thought. Um, let's check out our floating dock. Oh, we need two pieces of wood. That works perfect. Well, I should say it works perfect, but it doesn't mean that uh, we have uh, the money for it. So let's hold off on that, but let's go ahead and start building up this next area. Okay, cargo, you go hide. You go hide. We really need money. We are really hurting. Ooh, that's a big rock. What are you doing there? You're in my way. I can't get to my uh, other uh, thingamajiggy because you're in my way. <laughs> Can you move, please? No? Fine. I guess we have to wait till morning. Oh, is there a spate? Is there a dock? Oh, we need to go check that out over there. Uh, we'll check that out tomorrow. Okay. Hmm. There's a space over there I want to go check out that I did not see. And the light kind of amplified it. And I should be able to now get... Uh, middle one at least okay but there was a light up over at this area straight ahead what is that let's go check this out because there's there was a light over there i'm kind of curious what that light is i know we're getting kind of sidetracked that's okay um oh yeah we're supposed to bring his brother back weren't we um, I guess, eh, I want, okay, let's go check out this island first. I want to check out this island. I saw a light up here. I want to see what this light is.
I'm sure I saw a light out over here. I'm not going mad, right? I, I saw something out here, like a light. Right? That's the... Yeah, that's these things. I could have sworn I saw like a light out this way. Maybe I'm just going crazy. Maybe it was this? There are a couple ships over here. So let's... Whoa, 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 What is that? Okay. What? Whoa. That, that, that was, uh, that was, uh, something. Am I able to do anything over here? Fine. Prop. Chest peaks. Um... Let's look inside it. Ooh. Okay. Maybe that's what I saw. I don't know. That was that was crazy. Okay. So we have to watch out for apparently giant crabs uh, imitating uh, big scary uh, ships. Tiger mackerel. Huh? Is, hold on, I saw something. Hold on. Where is that uh, oceanic? Maybe it's this. I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, there's a big whale there. Tiger mackerel. Oh, we already have one of those. Okay. Okay, well, that was interesting. I guess we'll head back south. This is just, uh, one wild adventure today. We haven't even got around this island to see what's all out here yet. Yep, looks like another possibly wrecker fish and uh, another broken area. It takes us, it looks like, inside. Yes, it does. Ooh, what's this? An altar breaks through the waves at the base of the cliff. Three crab-like creatures are carved into it. The largest is covered in rocks and other strange shapes. So it sounds like we need to bring some crabs over here. I wonder how many we need. Let's see. If we get those big ugly ones, we could have one big one maybe here. Well, yeah. Looks like we have one big one and two small ones. Okay. So we have a... Where is it? Back here. Oh, we have to blow those still up too. Okay. So let's go do that. Uh... I think tomorrow morning. Okay. A gnash teeth. Gnashing perch. Endless and mindless. Driven only by the desire to consume. A purpose sated many times over. Alrighty. Uh, how much room do I have on boat? Enough. Ooh, what is that? Is that? If that's one of the... Uh... Yeah, we want that. I don't care. We're going to find a way to make this work. 
I don't care if I take the damage. I want that abyssal. <laughs> I'm being greedy, I know. Oh my gosh, come on. Don't care about you. I want that. Ooh, look at that thing. A withered ray. That is awesome looking. We're not too scared yet, so I'm not too worried about pushing this a little bit. Now that we're going to orange, maybe not. <laughs> and I think something may have been chasing us just there. <laughs> At least that's what it sounded like. 108, not terrible. 16. Eh. We'll take it. We will take it. Mm. Shipyard, I need you to fix my ship. It has a hole where I was silly and accidentally hit something. Um, I was gonna put you in there. Oh, that's gone. So apparently it's not there all the time. Interesting. I do want better lights. We need better lights. So we have that. We're missing metal scrap still? Nope, we have one. But we are missing... Another metal scrap, so we'll have to go looking for that. It's kind of interesting when you consider, like... Right here, you have four things to get to Tier 2. But to get to Tier 3, you only need half. You're, like, missing... Let's see, there's that. You're missing the net. And you're missing the light. But the next one, you definitely have to have a bunch of space, so... This one... Oh, wow. I think this one requires two of those metal things. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Um, do we have... Yeah, we have room. So let's go ahead and grab these. We're not too scared just yet. Um, I really should probably hold these until tomorrow. I'm gonna actually hold a couple of them. I don't think they have to be fresh, but I want to go see what that uh, statue does with these things. So let's... I want you, you, and you be held over. Okay, so you guys come back. Okay. And then let's sleep. And we're going to go see what this gives us. I'm really curious. Ooh, almost ran right into that. <laughs> I wasn't even paying attention. Ooh, well, let's grab this. Aberrations, I will always take. They are not common. They are very nice to have. Shattered wreckfish. Wow. And I think it is right over here. Yes, it was. Alright, so we need one of these. One of these, one of these. The three crabs shudder, legs clicking into strange angles. Though long dead, some unseen power commands their corpses into action. The crabs scuttle over the altar, disappearing into cracks in the stone. Suddenly the rock splits in two, revealing a sunken chamber at its core. Mouth of the deep, needs repaired. Gets three a day, six by six. So this is some type of uh, crab, uh, like crab trap? Yeah. 
If you look at the symbol, it's a crab. A formidable cage with vast gaping maw, sure to swallow up anything unlucky enough to stumble into it. Wow, but we have to fix it though. That kind of sucks. Let's go ahead and try our way around. I want to see what else we can find. It's so early. Um, is there... Yeah, there looks like there's something right here we can try and get. That looks like a research... Yeah, it was a research. Because it's like it didn't look like anything normal. Um, what is that? Sturgeon? Okay. Um, I want to kind of look at some of this over here. Hold on. That has metal. That has cloth. A ring and some wreck fish. More wood. Perch. And a dock. Let's go check out this dock real quick. But if we can avoid these lovely uh, traps <laughs> of hot, hot air. Campsite. You stand in the center of a campsite. The fire's embers are cool, but ash is still steadily blowing out of out with the wind. Hmm. Let's take a closer look at the campfire. A large flat rock sits atop the charred wood of the campfire. A handful of tiny fish bones can be seen poking out of the ashes. Kick the ashes. You kick the ashes. Your foot hits something hard at the bottom of the pile. You brush the remnants aside. And we have another research. Ooh. What do you want to do? Well, let's look at the footprints. You find no footprints, but unfamiliar symbols have been sketched in the dust nearby. Some have been erased with the hasty sweep of a foot. Um, well, let's check the makeshift tent. The tent is a sheet of cloth suspended over some sticks. There is nothing inside save for a smooth hollow in the dirt where someone slept. Well, alrighty. Well, that tells me pretty much everything we need to know about that place. Um, alright, we'll leave. Uh, let's go ahead and... What do we... We need a metal, right? We need a metal. Well, there's that. Okay. Let's get that metal and maybe this dredge item and we'll head on back. It's gonna be night time by the time we head back, but I think we ought to be fine. Ooh, do we not have room for another... No, we don't. Um, uh, well, maybe? I don't think we do. I don't think we have space, no matter what we do here. That's frustrating. Yeah, so we can't get another one of those. I don't think. Hold on. Can we? We can't put you there? Why not? Oh, well, it's a six by six. That darn tail doesn't go in. Oh, fooey sticks. All right. We'll leave that alone. Um, that's cloth, and we'll, we'll just get this little, uh, item here. And that's just a ring. Okay. And where are we? We need to work our way up and around. Okay. Let's try not to scare ourselves more than we need to, especially with the nightfall. Uh, but we are going to get back to our boat. 
our floating fortress, whatever you want to call it. And we will call it an episode tonight. And we need to remember to... Whoa! That came out of nowhere. That was uh, lucky that we missed that. But we do need to go get that old man. Actually, no, we need to blow up those uh, dynamite. Uh, we have kind of forgot about that. So we should definitely work on doing that uh, next episode. Let's get this floating dock. We need some metal. So that gives us more cargo space, as you can see up top. Um, let's see if we do the motor. Gives us one motor space. So let's... Let's actually get both of these, since we have the money. Alright, so... All we need to do now is start working towards... The... Rods, which look like it will populate right here. And we can... Start our way to actually a tier 3 hole, which will be nice. Uh, this gives us nine cargo spaces and another hit point, basically. Nice. Alright. Well, I hope you've enjoyed in, uh, joining me on this cruise through the game Dredge. And I hope to see you all in the next one.